really good actually, it was so much fun just uh, really seeing people's reactions when you're talking to them about this kind of stuff because there's a real appetite for it in the general public, especially in astronomy and for them to actually get the Tamil woman from a change is great as well. I really think soapbox science helps to address the gender imbalance, I mean, especially in astronomy, uh, in my subject. But it is getting better, and it's through programs like this that you know you engage with the public, not just the parents, but the kids themselves who see a female scientist, see that they actually exist, that they're normal people, uh, and that they live normal lives, but yet they know these amazing things. I decided to do soapbox science because it, firstly, it's a way, a way of communicating with different audiences, the audiences I've been able to communicate with, but. Women are generally less visible, so most of the famous scientists people can think of are men. I think programmes like Soapbox Science that make female scientists more visible are very important because the stereotypical scientist is still male. And I think it's really important to have more female role models to stop that kind of assumption, which then hopefully makes it easier for the next generation of scientists, next generation of schoolgirls and so on, to actually that they can picture themselves being a scientist. I think programs like this, like Soapbox Arts, can really help. Um, a lot of people have a knee-jerk reaction. They think of scientists, they think of a you know, man in a lab coat. They've got a kind of a visual image of some Einstein sort of figure with grey frizzy hair, and it's, it's not someone like them, basically. So Soapbox Science, there's a lot of women scientists out there, a lot of very, very good women scientists. So by putting us on display almost, putting us on a soapbox, so people can see we come in all sorts of you know, different study areas, different shapes and sizes, different sorts of people. Um, I think it's a really good idea. You know, to give an hour of my time on a Sunday afternoon, I'm, I'm quite happy to do that. I think it's really good when, for people to see that women are scientists too, because so often the idea of a scientist is a, a man in a white coat, so to see some women in a white coat, I think it's really great and really inspiring for people who come to see Soapbox Science events. Soapbox Science event just seemed a really good way to actually get out there and show your passion about a subject and encourage you know, young, young girls who might be interested in going sciences right through to perhaps those that are thinking about going back to university and studying again. I think it's really important to have women being role models because I think once children can see women doing science and being excited and active about these things, they then see how they can follow that path.